Well, hello. My name's Dan Pontifrac. It's me. I'm the author of this book, its second year anniversary, Lead Care Win, How to Become a Leader Who Matters. That's me, the bald guy. I'm here today to sort of provide a bit of an oversight as to what this book's all about. Well, basically, there's nine leadership lessons found in the book to help you become a leader who matters. Lead care win number one is be relatable. Number two, play for meaning. Then you stay present. You remain curious. You embrace change. Then you dare to share. You command clarity. You commit to balance. And finally, you champion others. So what do each of these mean? Well, number one, be relatable. Head, heart, hands, people. It's the signature of empathy. I'm sorry. You ask for help. You connect with others. That's number one. Number two, play for meaning. What does it mean? Well, are you here to help others? And are you answering the questions of why am I here? Who am I serving? And most importantly, what do they say when you leave a room? Number three, stay present. We're pretty distracted and busy. So why don't you do a time audit and put in some focus blocks and some team norms? For you and your team. Number four, remain curious. Well, Alice Coachman is a hero of mine. We'll get back to that. But uh, you lead off with learning. You engage others. You adapt to the situation. You then reinforce what you've learned. And then you nurture forward. That's just like Alice Coachman, who has this wonderful example back in her youth. Number five, embrace change. Well, there's all kinds of things about that. But mistakes will be made during the change. So lighten up. What's dare to share? Number six, you must share up, down, and around. Up with the people on your team, down because you have to go get it, and around the organization. Number seven, command clarity. Like Greta, who is a climate change activist, she's transparent and decisive, and she knows how to manage what's going on with her load. Number eight, commit to balance. We must be inclusive. We must recognize others, and we must diversify our team to be fair. And finally, number nine, to champion others, our job is to raise others up. We need to go out fishing together. I know. So the book itself, uh, Lead Care Win, comes in at just under 40,000 words. It just won the silver medal, the Nautilus Book Awards for the leadership and business category. Super excited about that, I must say. And I also wanted to kind of give a nice shout out to a couple of people who have helped me immensely uh, along my way as both an author and as um, someone who's trying to get better at my craft itself. And Amy Edmondson at uh, Harvard Business School, who called it Essential Reading. And of course, Whitney Johnson, who said, I know, Dan, Dan cares. That's so nice. So again, my name, Dan Pontifrac. Thanks for listening. The book, Lead Care Win, How to Become a Leader Who Matters. Visit leadcarewin.com com.